Nice, you want to open this show? Yes, sir. This is our first summer hunt club show. Maybe yep, cool. our first summer hunt club show. About to do a couple cameras. About to put some feed out. See what kind of bucks that we have. You want to talk about what the price of corn is? Oh, ten dollars a bag. Ten? I wish it was ten. Oh wait, what is it again? Fifteen dollars a bag. Fifteen. My bad. I was gonna cut into your lunch money. I'm not. Oh no. no. <laughs> who are we? Who are we meeting? Cheeseburger. Oh cheeseburger. Meeting cheeseburger at the least. This segment is brought to you by the crazy folks in this world. Oh, what you doing, cheese? Thoughts of cheeseburger. Oh, nothing much. Waiting on Philip. Are you waiting on Philip? What time is he supposed to be there? Uh, 11 o'clock. What time is it, cheese? It's 11.10. Oh, why is Philip late? Oh, uh, he lives in Georgia, but he runs on Alabama time. Oh, okay. Yeah. Most people wait on a woman. I'm just waiting on a Philip. <laughs> What's you doing, bud? Oh, sitting here in the truck. We on the way. We swinging through the tall to grass some corn. We'll be there. Good luck, man. I hope y'all got a finance plan with you. I spent one hundred and forty-two dollars on a pack of batteries, some corn, and some beef jerky. Okay, that's cool, man. I'm good. All right, we'll see you second. Yeah, man. Right. Waiting on to fill up. Tell you, he ain't even got it. He ain't even got his corn. Get your corn. <laughs> Let's go, Brandon. And then the next chance gonna be come on, fill up. What up? It's supposed to warm up here in a little bit, just be patient. Yeah, well, you know, I got off at six this morning. I know the head guy over this operation, he was like, let's meet at 10. No, wait, 11. <laughs> no, you know what? 11's not hot enough. I'll get there at 1145. <laughs> So, it's already 93. That's it, just 93? I think I got, <laughs> hold on, I, I gotta get out and officially meet Mr. Cheeseburger, because I've never met him. Mason has, I have. What's up, Cheeseburger? How you doing? Chris. Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger. I don't know, nobody calls you Chris. If you robbed a bank, they say so, Cheeseburger robbed a bank. Hey, like my caller ID when I call somebody, and it has to be a first and a last name, so it's Cheeseburger. I called the probate <laughs> court to check on some warrants, and they thought it was a prank call. <laughs> Yeah, you I got the fish hook. Look at that. Uh, there you go. I ain't playing with no snakes. It's like three inches of what for? When you hit the snake, he says what for? <laughs> Good grief. All right, let's just let's take a tour right to the back. We're going to follow you. Yeah. It's the first official work day. If you want to call it that, I call this corn day. $15 a bag. Just like pouring that's, money on that's the ground. That's what I said earlier. I bet them guys buying that biodiesel that's made out of corn taking life. We're at the very back end of the club here. We had to actually blindfold Mason to get back here. Yeah, this is a trial he, and so error. Yeah, this is, we're just trying to pick a deer up and then maybe get a feeder going. But I, we're at the back side, which I ain't even told Cheeseburger about this. This is the first, the test I've done on the new Spartan, the Spartan M. Okay. So, which we got pretty good service here, but this actually is pretty neat because it pulls off whatever Verizon, AT&T deal, it pulls off whatever's the best signal it's got. Really? Yes, they call it a smart carrier. The same price as normal, yeah. normal service. It's just a new perk. I'll sell you one. I bet you will. <laughs> Just don't write me a check. Oh, what you think, Mace? Hot? Hot, very, very hot. Got to put her up. Trial run. First camera of 2000. No, I got you beat, buddy. See? Yeah. You didn't see my post? I, I didn't. I ain't been on Instagram. I ain't been on Instagram lately. Like it's hunt club official, man. It's off season, man. <laughs> oh, that kills me right there. That's like pouring out a paycheck. Yeah. Throwing that and gas. Let's go, Brandon. That's a full hour's worth of work. There's another hour. Two hours right there I, in about thirty seconds. You could have thrown it out one kernel at a time. Make you feel like you got your money worth. Yeah. Yellow jacket. Pretty bad this year. So. I don't do yellow jackets and don't do snakes. In the truck or in the creek, one of the two. I guarantee you that. I'd rather see a rattlesnake than some yellow jackets. We're headed down here to an undisclosed location. We let Mason and Cheeseburger get ahead of us. I brought Mark in here. I don't bring many people in here. No, I'm. 
So this is the what we call limpy stand, but I'm gonna throw this Eclipse camera up, and it's actually it's a non-sale camera, but it's still got a wide angle lens. You still get high, good high res pictures, but just obviously not on the not on what your typical Spartan is, but yeah, Philip still a good trail camera. Philip tried to, he started to blindfold me. I said, dude, I'm not coming in <laughs> here, I promise you. He ain't Marsh. Is, the good thing about this time of year, Mark ain't even looking where we're going. He's looking for snakes. I'm looking down, so. I'm looking for snakes. I don't so. how we got in here. <laughs> we're going to set it up and let it roll. 108 degrees on the camera. Yeah, is that a Spartan? Yeah, it's a Spartan. It's just it's not a cell camera. Okay. So it's just a regular trail camera. It's pretty neat. It's got that back on it. Yeah. The adjust. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I've never seen them. Run it up higher. You know, you know how you always have to get sticks. Right. You that's up, what I have to do. I do sticks and just, and just tilt it down. That's cool. All right. Throw some corn out, let it roll. Come back and check it in a couple weeks. We're in them. If it don't melt. Seventh inning stretch right here, guys. You got your camera on the right angle? Yeah. Makes you ready to roll. We're getting to the big field, man. There was some deer killed here last year. Parker killed a coal buck. Poke him when you go. Or get, kick him something make sure he's dead. The gun ain't even loaded. <laughs> okay, I, <laughs> shot him in the neck. He's dead. Grab him, pick him up. What do you think about that one, dude? You did shot him right in the throat, didn't you? Well, does that count as a point? No. <laughs> Sorry. How's it feel to be tied out in Georgia? I don't know. I guess good. I've never done it before. And then Wes, uh, my good buddy Shane's son, he dumped a couple does out here. Shot two. That dead on with that bush nail. Hey, you can see it good in low light too, couldn't you? Yeah. Awesome. And then Corbin was with me, it was his, being with me, it was his first kill where he didn't pull the trigger, but it don't matter in his eyes, it was his deer, and that's how you get them started, but. Okay, you ready? You want me to shoot her? Ready? We got it. We got it, baby. <laughs> we 
my cat is a deer. <laughs> you go get her. I'm about to cry. You about to cry? Why are you about to cry? Because I see her. You so excited? Like you did when you shot that though? Yeah. You gonna go get her? Yes, sir. You okay? Goodbye, but I love you. <laughs> Daddy, you, you don't want to shot it. You shot it too. You helped me. We sit here and warm out. So we're going to pull down here. Philip started this mineral site a couple of years ago. He dumped that licking grow in here, man. They, it, it looked like they're looking for water. Like they have dug a well out. So we're going to stop by here and uh, freshen that mineral hole up. All right, Mason, since they ain't here, it's time to break out the top secret stuff. Cookies and cream brownie. I've never seen that. Me either, but it's got to be awesome because brownies are awesome, so are cookies and cream. Yes. So give us a bite and tell us what we're working with there, little mason. Mm. Oh, you better hurry up. Here they come. It's good. That's pretty good brownie? Mm -hmm. Okay. Better than a regular brownie? Oh, way better. Okay. Nothing to say here, guys. Just keep on driving. Just keep on driving. You got that crazy look in your eye. Don't know what you're talking about, sir. <laughs> Finding a lick and grow hole. We're about to juice it up. Vietnamese punji pit is what it looks Good like. Lord. They're in it, man. Mason, try to do a belly flaw. That that's not new. Oh, you got it? Yeah. But I smell that when you walk by. Oh yeah, this stuff right here. Oh, I can smell it. It's strong. This one we need to start doing. It's dumping. Oh, they love it. That stuff is strong. Like sweet tar. Smells like Kool-Aid. Yeah. Let me see, Philip. Smell that. It smells like uh, it, it like smells sweet. like some kind of switch or sweet tobacco or something. <laughs> you gonna sling it? You want me to sling it, Mason? Why don't you get started, please? That's the definition of a lick and grow hole. Up. This is this is the actually the very first time we ever did anything. Any video period wise for hunt clubs right here. I remember that. It was, yeah. I saw, and it that, was half as that, that was your reel, like introducing. This is where it all began, right That's here on the club. Time I saw you. Was on that video. Yeah. Probably. Well, this ain't where it ends. This but ain't where something's this, gonna end right here. Yeah, this ain't where I mean, it ends. This may be where the show technically ends. It episode. was all beginning and it's gonna be some yeah. deer's <laughs> end. That's a hundred percent. First summertime episodes wrapping up. Mason, come here. For everybody that's not subscribed or following us on Instagram and YouTube, what do they need to do? Subscribe and follow Hunt and, Club. And you, oh, you reveal what's in your no, pocket. Okay, here it. we go, and we're getting to this. I had to catch him off guard. Until next time. It's a little muddy. My breath's already hitting the rock. It's just a little muddy here. Adventure into the hunt club.